Hello there and welcome back for another video. I am Brown Eyes. Thank you guys so, so much for all of your positive feedback, your likes, your shares, and your subscribes, and even your comments. I really, really do appreciate you guys so, so much. So today it's all about your potential new lover or the old lover. We're trying to see who is connected to you, who is trying to come towards you energetically. Uh, feel free to go back and check my other videos because I've already uploaded some. Now I'm about to do Pisces. These readings are general. They may or may not resonate with you. Just take the part that fits and just discard the rest because there's no need in stressing, okay? So what I've done, Pisces, I've already pre-shuffled the deck and I've pulled your cards to save time and so that I can move on to other videos and other signs. So I pulled one card from my Psychic Tarot Heart deck and one card from my Kipper deck. So hopefully we're going to find um, the new lover's energy and the old lover's energy. So your first card coming out, actually you have two number nines over here. Your first card, uh, Pisces, or the energy connected to you is dark as fear. So I feel like I feel like this is the past energy, the old lover here. I feel like someone is full of anxiety. Someone is in their head. Someone needs to heal. Someone is going through mental anguish at this time um, because of their, they're in low vibrational energy. So the card on the, on the bottom of the deck is also a number nine card and it is rest and reconsider. So in order for this person to rest and reconsider, first of all, they have had to consider so this is someone who is obviously from your past. You have history with. I feel like this person had to take time away from you. This person's not talking to you. This person pulled back their energy. They disconnected from you. They could have either even uh, disconnected from the world. You know, you haven't seen or heard from this person. And it's because they're trying to get their thoughts together. It's like they're trying to conquer this darkest fears. And I feel like once they rest which is kind of like a introspection mode or hermit mode where they can just be in solitude and go spiritual, then I feel like they can um, heal this situation and come out of this darkest fears. And, and their consideration would be a reconsideration. And instead of thinking negatively, they'll come back with a positive energy for you. So that's why I feel like this is um, the old lover here. But now coming over here on your right-hand side, um, out of the Kipper deck, we have the number 24, which is Thief. I feel like this person is your potential new lover, Pisces. I feel like this person has a very, very rocky past. I feel like this person used to do things. This person was into a lot of negative things. This person was a thief, like the card says. This person, and it, it doesn't necessarily mean this person was pickpocketing. They could have, um, you know, they could have did unfair practices. They could have. Uh, lied about you know giving people stuff and withheld things or or whatever it whatever uh, taking something that doesn't belong to you pertains to whatever it's, it's all types of examples okay so I feel like your person is trying to come out of this because this was a lifestyle for them I feel like your person stole for a living or your person conned people for a living but under on, on the bottom of the deck we have the number 39 card which is community so I feel like your person feels like with all of your your um, emotional loving energy, Pisces, I feel like your person feels like you can help change them and bring them to a better place where they don't have to do the things they used to do because I feel like they don't want to do that anymore. I feel like them meeting you has inspired them to want to make some changes because I feel like they feel like you're very supportive of them and you're the type of person that they need in order for them to get out of this negative lifestyle that they're so accustomed to living here. So let me clarify these cards. So clarify darkest fears for Pisces new lover or old lover. Darkest fears, please. Clarify darkest fears for Pisces new lover, old lover, please. So see, we have the Ten of Swords here. So this is coming from, I feel like, the past uh, lover here, the old lover. 
Ten of Swords, this person's darkest fears is that they either they feel like they're going to betray you again or they feel like they're going to be betrayed. Um, some type of disappointment here. I feel like their darkest fears is that it's not going to happen the way they would like it to. So clarify darkest fears for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify darkest fears. See, you have the Six of Cups here. So this is someone from your past. Someone you have a spiritual connection with, a, a past life connection with. It could even be a spiritual connection or soulmate. This person is, is feeling betrayed or this person is, is in fear that, um, that I feel like they will be disappointed or they will disappoint you because of things that took place in the past. So I feel like this person is trying to release themselves from negative negative things between the two of you that took place in the past. Not only did it take place from the past, this person is from your past. And I feel like you guys have a spiritual soulmate connection here. So let's clarify this Ten of Swords for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify Ten of Swords. So we have this page of wands here. I feel like your person wants to reach out to you, Pisces, and, and give you, bring you some good news. This person wants to kind of flirt with you. I feel like after they come out of this rest and reconsideration, their, uh, their, re their reconsideration is to come back, but to come back in a better place. Clarify the Ten of Swords for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify Ten of Swords, please. Line them up. Okay. Now you have the Six of Pentacles here. I feel like this person wants to come and tell you. This person wants to express that they have something for you. Or maybe they're trying to, they want to come out and reach out and tell you that they want to balance the scales. They want to be fair with you. They want this to be an equal give and take. They want to, they just want to be fair to you. Cause I feel like they, they wasn't fair to you because of their issues. They had issues. So clarify six of cups for Pisces, please. Yeah, my grandbaby, my grandson, he's he he runs the house. He running everywhere, okay? So the Six of Cups, you have, your person has this Nine of Cups. So it is their wish fulfilled to come back to you. It is their wish fulfilled, but they can't come back to you in the state that they're in. Because if they come back in the state that they're in, they're going to always be in this Ten of Swords energy. Or they're going to always put you in this Ten of Swords energy, Pisces. Clarify Six of Cups for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify Six of Cups, please. And we have the Nine of Pentacles. So, I feel like it is your person's wish fulfilled. That they can be abundant and independent. I don't know why this nine of pentacles here. I feel like they can they wish fulfill that you could be that they could be abundant. Or is or as they wish fulfill is that they can come back to you and you be single. Because that may be one of their darkest fears is that you're already involved with someone here. So I feel like their wish fulfilled is to come back and you're doing good, but you're available for them. Because like I say, see, they've taken they've taken a break from you. So you probably went on with your life and start, you know, mingling with other people because this person's resting. Rec reconsider this person look like they, they the only one in the world. So you may have not seen this person or heard anything of this person. So you probably went on out and started doing your own thing. And so I feel like this person was in their fears because... Because of they ghosted you or because of their insecurities, I feel like they did not give equally to this relationship because of their own issues. But it seems like now they want to reach out to you and express uh, how they feel. But they hoping that you're single and available when they do approach you, Pisces. So this is what I feel like is your old lover here on the left hand side. Now, coming over here on the right hand side out of the Kipper deck, we have Thief, remember, number 24. Now, I feel like this is the potential 
new lover. But the potential new lover has a very shady past. This person, it was kind of like a seven of swords energy. This person practiced stealing. This person's lifestyle was on this, this type of energy here. So clarify thief for Pisces, new lover or old lover, please. Clarify thief. So you have the hermit card. Y'all see that? Got the hermit. I feel like this person, like I said, I feel like this person looked upon, looks upon you like you can help them. You can motivate them. You can support them. You can give them the support they need to make this change. And I feel like this person has did a lot of introspect. This person has went within to search out answers on how to come out of this thief energy or to come out of this negative lifestyle here. So clarify thief for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify thief, please. So you have the lovers. So see, this person really had to do a lot of introspecting and going within to search, uh, you know. They had to do a lot of spiritual praying and meditating and stuff so that they can make better choices in life. I feel like this person, this person feels like you can help them make the better choices in life because they're trying to be more mature about the choices that they make in life and about things that they do because they're going to have to answer to those things. So I feel like your person is maturing with your help or they feel like you're, you're very, uh, you, you can help them bring that about. So clarify the hermit for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify the hermit, please. See, you have the hierophant. So I feel like your person has really been, uh, is in, we're clarifying the hermit. Your person has really been uh, seeking spiritual help or from elders. I feel like your person has really been going within from a spiritual perspective. And I feel like they get that from you too. Because Pisces, since you are a psychic, uh, emotional, watery energy, I feel like this person feels like you, you're the community. You're, you're the... Um, you're the protection, you're the healer, you're the support that they need because your support is positive and healing. So I feel like they have been, while they were introspecting, they've been seeking out for spiritual counsel in order to come out of this ne negative uh, past lifestyle energy that they were in. So clarify their hermit for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Come on, clarify Pisces, please. And you have the Knight of Wands. So it's like this person, this person had to get a better understanding on life in order to uh, move forward. But this person could also had to, had to go in introspection, do a lot of soul searching in order to be more committed because we do have the lovers here. So I feel like this person, now we're clarifying ultimately thief. So this person could have just been a thief of hearts. This person could have been the type of love them and leave them type of person here because we do have the Knight of Wands here. So I feel like this person don't, don't want to be a player no more if it's related to uh, emotions. But if it's just a lifestyle thing where you're stealing property and you, you're living and you're just doing shady shit, then I feel like this person had to um, seek out higher spiritual counsel. But if it's for romance, like I said, if this person just used to steal hearts and just uh, mislead women and just women or men, we're talking about uh, energy, mislead people, get what they want and then ghost them and leave them and stuff. Then I feel like this person is trying to heal their self and find a better way to handle their emotions and how to come out of this immature behavior in order to be more stable and more com committable um, so that they won't have to be in and out and they won't have multiple lovers and they'll make the right choices in life. So let's clarify the lovers for Pisces, new lover or old lover. Clarify the lovers. Damn. Well, you got the six of cups, so you may have known this person too. Damn, Pisces, it look like you got two potential soulmates here. You got an old one and a new one here. 
this person, I think you've met this person before, but you may have not gotten involved with them like that. But I feel like they want to be more committed with you. And I feel like it is someone that you have a spiritual soulmate connection with because you have the lovers and the six of cups. Over here, you have the six of cups from the past. The past lover, you have the six of cups and the, the potential new lover, you have uh, the lovers and the six of cups. So clarify the lovers for Pisces, new lover or old lover, please clarify the lovers. You got two spiritual connections here, two soulmate connections here, possibly. So now you have the king of swords here. So I feel like this person wants to come back to you. I don't feel like you guys were in a real big relationship. I just feel like, I feel like this person had their own negative lifestyle that they were going through, but I feel like you guys could have been just friends, but I feel like you made an impression on this person, this potential new lover here. Uh, but I feel like this person could have been a womanizer, you know, just, just love them and leave them, take what they wanted. That's a form of thief. And I feel like now that they had to go within and do some soul searching in order to make better choices in their relationships and how they treat people, then I feel like they had to reach out and get a higher level of understanding spiritually. And now I feel like they want to come back to you and tell you the truth and be truth and honest with you, uh, Pisces here. I feel like they want to be real and honest with you because they, they look upon you as someone that they can trust who they feel like is, is very supportive of them, no judgment, someone who can help them. So Pisces, this has been your reading for your new lover or your old lover, my darling. So if this video resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe and leave me a comment and I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.